Hey guys, coming to you from the Bad Seed Studio. And Eliza just got this from Gustav in Sweden. And it's just kind of a, what you would find in a post-apocalyptic world with salvaged parts, put together some body armor versus something more commercialized like this vest, which is just neoprene and nylon all stitched together. Well, what do you guys think? What would somebody wear under them and how would you combine the three of these to make something even better? This is what Chet's wardrobe looks like so far. He's just doing a quick walkthrough so we can see what it is. We were just doing some other tests, but it's the only footage I have where he's in wardrobe. Anyway, he needs body armor. Um, Pal has a really cool looking body armor. I wanted him to look kind of eclectic, just like the vehicle he drives. He drives Thumper and it's all pieced together from whatever he needed, but it, it works. It does what it needs to do. But Chet's a little more refined. You know, he drives a military vehicle and he's obviously stolen himself some military fatigues where it's even maybe like a, a flight suit. It's a single, you know, type of suit. So I wanted to be able to show that off by a simple body armor that, you know, is not really very restricting. You know, it's not like heavy body armor. And I didn't want to go with anything that's from today. You know, this is in the future and it's kind of, it's almost fantasy, but it's still sci-fi, but it's in the future. So anyway, I didn't want to do anything that's from like G.I. Joe or any of the other, you know, video games or I don't know, Halo, whatever. I, I want it to be very, very unique, but very simple. In, and we have the basis to, you know, to work off of what, what we already bought. So anyway, it's been a long night. So let's talk about it. I'm going to put a little picture on there so you can figure out how to upload photographs to LiveLeak. And we'll do the vote on LiveLeak. Which one do you like, A, B, or C? And uh, it's really easy. Try and find some pictures and show us what you think would look good and let's talk about it. We're finally to the point of shooting. I mean, there's like nothing left. We have the lasers, wardrobe, the vehicles. I mean, everything is here. And we've got some other really cool news for you guys, but I don't want to let the cat out of the bag yet. But it looks like things are really coming around. Talk to you guys later. Bye.